Oh my god, you guys. I am so freaking excited. I got the Tarte Park Avenue Princess Vault. So it comes with a whole bunch of stuff. So many things in here. I'm gonna read everything that it says on the vault and go over the packaging and everything. It also came with brushes. It's just beautiful. I did purchase this for myself. I did not get this NPR or anything like that. I just really wanted to get this vault. I feel like you should treat yourself. Own your own crown like the vault says. So the whole vault is $159 on the Tarte website and I did the math and you do end up saving money instead of buying all of these items individually. And if you're new to my channel, hey my name is Sylvia. Thank you so much for being here. So this is the front of of it and then on the inside it says being a Park Avenue princess means owning what you've got hustling like a girl boss and looking fierce AF through it all it embodies the girl who wears her crown is confident in her skin and does her makeup on her own terms she's not afraid to break the rules or demand the best that's why our Park Avenue princess line is infused with the queen ingredient of nature Amazonian clay to make sure your face looks flawless from day tonight so i'm gonna be creating a whole look with the items and i'm gonna do swatches for you guys and everything i will put the prices of the individual items on the screen so you guys can see how much each of the individual items are on the website and i'm so excited oh my god i'm sorry but my nose is so runny i don't know why i'm not sick or anything like that so the only thing i have on my face right now is my base so foundation concealer cream contouring and then i set my face with powder already okay so the bowl comes with five different brushes it is the goal getters contour brush set so here are the brushes that come in the ball. So they have like a rose gold finish and glitter handles. So they're very, very nice brushes. And then there are pink brushes at the top. These brushes just look so pretty. I love the packaging. They feel super, super soft. I'm gonna be using them today. So soft. Okay, and then this is the Park Avenue Princess Chisel Palette. And oh my god, you guys, this packaging is like I die. The Park Avenue letters are raised. Feels really, really nice and good quality. So this is a bronzer palette. Comes with a really big mirror. And then these are the shades that are in here. Some highlighting shades. And then these are bronzer and contouring shades. And then this is the Park Avenue Amazonian Clay Waterproof Bronzer. So this is not a new item, but it does have new limited packaging. I believe it's one of their popular bronzers. This is how it looks on the inside. I love just the design and it comes with a mirror. I love the packaging of this. The letters are also raised. Feels really really nice i just love how everything is shiny and metallic and then it also comes with a chrome paint shadow pot in the shade park avenue princess and this is a new product so that's how it looks on the inside and i'm just gonna swatch it really quick wow that is and intense you guys so that is a swatch of the park avenue princess chrome paint it looks so freaking nice wow that's just one swipe and it's so pigmented i can't wait to put this on my eyes seriously you guys that looks so nice it's like a copper bronzy shade okay and then it comes with the tartius quick dry matte lip paint and the shade park avenue princess it says lip bling right here in the front this is the applicator of the lip stick let me swatch it on my hand it is definitely lip bling it's super metallic and shiny and then it comes with two lip bling highlighting lip paint comes with a lighter one so this one is called high standards i love the packaging of all of this it feels kind of sticky and then this one is park avenue princess it's a lip paint so when i opened it a little bit of like kind of this liquid came out so i don't know if supposed to be shaken you got it everywhere so that's the wand of the lip paint oh my god this looks like a really pretty color 
kind of looks like a dark peachy nude park avenue lip paint this is the lip bling high standards and then the next one is also a lip bling park avenue princess these two right here are lip blings and then this is the quick dry matte lip paint they're definitely not easy to come off <laughs> i'm like taking trying to take them off my hand and the lip bling pretty hard to come off they're very 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 glittery okay so i'm first gonna start with the chisel palette and i'm gonna grab one of these brushes so since i already did cream contouring i'm gonna actually use the big fluffy brush that what's in the brush set so I'm gonna just use these two right here I'm gonna mix them together angle and crown and I'm just gonna bronze my face and they smell so good you guys they smell so good and wow that is really pigmented so you only need a little bit So the shade crown has a little bit of a sheen to it so that's why I wanted to use that one because I kind of want like my face to look bronzy. You definitely just need a little bit of this. And then I'm just grabbing angle, putting it on my forehead and hairline. So you want to get really close to your hairline so that it looks more natural. I'm also going to use these shades as eyeshadows. Okay, and then I'm going to grab the smaller one and I'm going to use the shade Princess Cut. Barely dip it in here and use it to contour my nose. I like to put a little bit of contour underneath my lip just to make them look a little bit more plump. Okay, so now with that same brush, I'm gonna grab this shade called Angle. I'm gonna use it as a transition shade. You guys, these powders blend out so nicely. I barely have to like apply and blend them out for them to just blend and so I'm just grabbing a little bit and then building them up okay and then I'm grabbing a little bit of this shade called carrot I'm just applying it on top of that other color that I put down you guys I've been waiting to use these brushes for the longest I haven't even washed my other brushes because I've been wanting to use these for so long okay I actually almost forgot about this one okay so i'm actually gonna grab park avenue princess bronzer and i'm gonna grab the angled brush and i'm gonna use the pointy side and i'm actually gonna use that to kind of just contour a little bit more oh never mind it actually has a shimmer to this bronzer actually i have never used it before so you do not want to use it for contouring you want to use it more for bronzing so I'm actually gonna do that with this bronzer wow it's so pretty it definitely gives you like a bronzy look this one looks really really pretty I feel like it will look so pretty in the summer I also feel like it'll look really nice on the lids so I'm gonna grab and a small brush and I'm applying it all over my eyelid and then I'm gonna grab like a really small pencil brush and I'm gonna grab some of that Park Avenue and apply it underneath my lower lash line I'm seriously gonna look like I went to the beach and it's winter. <laughs> that looks so pretty. I'm gonna grab the shade Crown, which is the darkest shade. Apply that on the outer portion of my eye. These smell so good. Okay, so now I'm gonna grab the Chrome Paint. With my finger, I'm gonna apply it on my lid. pretty and you need just a tiny amount a little bit will go a long way this is so pretty 
feel like you get the best payoff with these using your finger. I'm gonna grab a little bit with my pencil brush and apply right here on the inner lower lash line. Okay, and then I'm gonna go back with that shade, with the shade crown, apply right here on the outer corner just to give a little bit more dimension and in my crease. I really like that you can use these as eyeshadows also. Just a little bit more on the lower lash line. All right, so I'm gonna do my eyeliner, mascara. I'm gonna apply some false lashes and do my eyebrows off camera. I'm also gonna apply just a little bit of blush on my cheeks. Be right back. Okay guys, so I just applied my false lashes eyeliner and I did my eyebrows. So I'm going to go in with the chisel palette and I'm going to use the highlighting shades. So I'm going to use the shade Enhance and I'm going to grab the tapered brush and I'm just going to apply it where I would normally apply highlighter and underneath my eyes. And then I'm going to grab this other light shade and put it in the inner corner of my eyes just to highlight right there and my brow bone. Since we're using Tarte products, I'm going to use uh, the Amazonian Clay Highlighter and the shade Sparkler. I'm going to grab that same brush and just highlight a little bit. Nose. Pupus bow and on my chin. Okay, and then I'm gonna use the Park Avenue Princess lip paint. And then I'm gonna use a little bit of the Park Avenue Princess lip bling and put it in the middle of my lips. I'm actually going to apply a little bit of lip liner, this lip liner by Huda Beauty. Just going to spray my face with the Morphe Setting Mist. I'm going to use a little bit of that highlighting shade and the angled brush just to clean up right here the contour. Actually, I'm going to use my beauty sponge to do that. And just blend it out all right guys so this is the finished look and honestly I just loved everything in this vault I hope you guys enjoyed this video please leave me your comments below on what you think about these products have you tried any of them don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up and I hope to see you guys in my next video bye and cream contouring me asustaste. De verdad. Sí. No te creo. Oh, shit. Excuse me.